This freaking judge, this piece of shit of a judge will not let President Trump go to his own son's graduation. Excuse y'all, excuse my language, but you have to be a fucked up individual to stop a man from attending his son's graduation. You, you think you hurting Trump? No, you are hurting his son. That man needs his father at his graduation. He want his father to be there. But you think you hurting Donald Trump when you really hurting a child. You hurting this little boy who needs his father. This stupid ass court case is not even important at all. It's a bunch of bullshit. And then the judge won't Trump to be in the court. He wants Trump to be in court every damn day. And if he's not, he's going to jail. That's a bunch of bullshit, y'all. And not only that, Judge Juan, his daughter, worked for Kamala Harris. She worked for Kamala Harris's campaign. These are facts, people. What did Trump do so bad that he is not allowed to go to his son's graduation? What did he do? This case is full of, I, I don't even want to talk about the case because it's a nothing, it's, it's, it's all bull, it's all BS. This is, not, this is not about Trump doing something wrong. This is not about Trump. This is all about trying to slow him down. This is all about trying to inf trying to interfere with this election that's no they're not trying to they are interfering with the election right now they're doing anything possible to hurt this man anything possible can't go to the son's graduation can't do this can't do that he can't talk Trump can't talk or he go to jail. Trump can't do this or he go to jail. Trump can't blink or he go to jail. Trump can't eat or, or he go to jail. This is, y'all, this is straight up political. This is not about Trump committing crimes. This is not about Trump doing anything wrong. This is straight up political. And this is why I keep saying we cannot play nice with people who are playing dirty. We cannot play by the rules when we cannot play by the rules when the other side is clearly not playing by the rules. These people play dirty to win and we cannot, we absolutely cannot, cannot play by the rules anymore. They have crossed every fucking line possible. Every line they have crossed. They have crossed every boundary there's no going back. And that's why I'm calling on all these Republicans to step the hell up. I don't give a shit if you don't have anything on these Democrats. I don't care what you have on them or not. I don't care if you have evidence or not. Go after them. That's what they do to us. They go after us with no evidence. They go after us when they go after Trump. And other people who haven't done anything but have but fight for this country and try to put America first, they go out to people simply for that. So we need to step up and we need to go after all of them. Go after Alvin Bragg. Go after Fannie Willis. Go after these people. Dig stuff on them. Dig up stuff on them. Make shit up. I don't give a damn. That's what they do to us. Let's play this. Let's let's play the same game. Let's play the same game. They don't care. They don't care if there's evidence. They don't care if Trump did anything wrong or not. All they care about, all they care about is making him look like a horrible person. And we need to do the same to them. This, <laughs> I don't want to be a politician, but if I was in office, oh shit, they wouldn't like me. Oh, they would, they, they would not like me. 
because I wouldn't I would do the same thing they're doing. Anyways, y'all, this is insane. I don't care what side you on. This is crazy. This is absolutely insane. We got to get this country back. Because the people that's running this country and doing this shit, they, they are going to do this to everybody who voted for Trump if Trump don't win. I'm telling you that right now.